All right, ladies and gel gentlemen, we are back after uh, after about a week off. I uh, hope you guys had a merry X Men and uh, got some cool shit. And uh, let's play some fucking Final Fantasy IV: The After Years. So take off your pants, crack open a beer ski, and give in to the grind. That was uh, sharp. Felt, felt a little sharp on the old leperinos. All right. Hopefully I'm not bleeding. If I am, who cares? Let's play some Final Fantasy IV, The After Years. So uh, we're continuing uh, Porum's story here. And uh, it's like a flashback right now. So let's do it. Hope you guys got some cool shit for X-Men. And also cool shit... Uh, on Boxing Day, which is the which is the real fucking celebratory day, I got me a PlayStation Classic. Um, I've half hacked it. I, I've got uh, Bushido Blade Two working on there, but I can't figure out how to get like more than one game working for some reason. But I was also in a big hurry, so I'll definitely look at that tonight after I'm done streaming. Anyways. Back to uh, Final Fantasy IV, The After Years. Wait a minute, Palum, that's too dangerous. That monster's at the bottom of the, the, this waterfall. Isn't there any other path? Doesn't look like it, you scared. No, of course not. So, let's go. How about treasure? Oh, never mind. Alright, straight to the boss, I guess. How about, uh, treasure? How about? Um, I'm pretty sure these guys are, uh, weak against Thundara. I mean, they're fucking mermen, so I don't see why they wouldn't be. Nice. That was maybe a little too OP. It's been, it's been about a week since I played this game now, so... I've definitely, uh, forgotten what I was doing for the most part. In fact, I wasn't even sure if I was like in the middle of someone's story or if I was like on the on the verge of starting a new story. So that goes to tell you uh, where my mind is as far as actually like playing this game. Let's try regular thunder. It will probably be more than enough to deal with these guys. Except for the alligator apparently. But if I use regular thunder on just him, it should fuck him up. Die, bitch! Wow. Not dead. Now dead, right? Yes. Yes, dead. Okay. Hopefully this is like a... No? Okay. This is like the next floor. So let's, uh... Let's get some fucking sexy-ass treasure. High pot. Ether. Also, I've been, like, really tired lately, and I don't know why. It's been, like, this whole, like, Christmas season has been, like, nap-tastic, if that makes any goddamn sense. I've been just napping. My wife has been napping. I don't know what it is, but it's been a pretty fucking nappy time for some reason. And I'm not sure why. But I'm sure the beer will help with that. Everyone knows beer doesn't make you sleepy, right? Silver armlet, Hermes sandals. Um, let's equip the silver armlet. Defense. Uh, yeah, let's put it on Porum since she's the main character of this story. And, uh, yeah. Yeah! Oh yeah, I'll, uh, also I'll be streaming pretty much all day tomorrow, so I'm hoping to like either finish this game or get a good chunk of this game finished. Please don't take a lot. 11, that's not bad. Have a good chunk of this game uh, done by the end of tomorrow anyways. I'd really like to move on to, to Final Fantasy V to be completely honest, but uh, hey. 
Uh, it's nothing against this game. It's just it's a lot of it's a lot of Final Fantasy IV to. Oh, it's that octopus again. What? Here goes my first test on the path to sagehood. I thought we killed this fucking guy. Don't let your guard down. I know, I know. Oh, it's a cooler mammoth. It's different. I get it. I don't get it. Okay, let's just attack. Oh, these are considered leeches? What? Let's just attack, okay? Let's just use, uh, Thundara on the whole damn thing. Wait, no, let's do it on the cooler mammoth. Die, bitch! Oh, it heals him. Wow, that's fucking horrible. Okay. Let's try, uh, any, literally any other spell. Oh, great, he cast Shell on himself. That's pretty cool. Um, let's try, uh, Blizzara. So far, our health is fine. We're fine. Dude, I hope this actually does damage. Oh, not bad. The shell thing was pretty annoying. Uh, I'm gonna start healing now. Let's try... I wonder if I should, like, protect and, and shell us. Um, let's try Fyra. See how that works. And yeah, I'm going to uh, protect... Both of us. And then I'm gonna also shell us. Let's see what does more. Oh, so fire does more damage to the middle guy, but blizzard does more damage to the limbs. I think the middle guy is what we want to focus on here, so, uh, yeah. Oh, I don't have shell. Okay. Um, let's cast Libra on that motherfucker and see what's up. Nothing? Okay. Libra is the most useless spell, apparently. Nine eleven. Nice. Good damage. 84. That's pretty fucking powerful. I'm definitely gonna have to heal him. Okay, um... Yeah, let's just use Cure on both. Why not? It's only 9, so not a big... Not a big fucking deal. Doing a thousand damage to him is, uh, pretty good, actually. Wow, my hair. <laughs> this is fucking terrible. Terrible! I should've worn my toque, but at the same time... At the same time, I don't want to. Because it makes me sleepier for whatever reason. Dude, do I have this spell? That would be great. I should check if I have this spell. I don't know if this spell would be black magic. Hey, Fates! You never get tired of this boss song? All the music in this game is, like, fantastic. I like the fiends. The four fiends music is a lot better, I think. I'm gonna cast, uh, Silence. See if that'll work. How was your X-Men, by the way? And how was your Boxing Day? Boxing Day is the real holiday. Dude, did si oh, I was gonna say, silence actually worked? Nice. Thousand damage. Uh, we'll go one more turn. Fire a bitch! I don't know if, uh... A, if Palom has Osmos, and B, if it's worth using? Oh, he's dead. Good. I wasn't sure if I should be attacking that middle guy or not, but turns out it paid off. I just gotta, like, clean my glasses, I think. That might be part of why I'm so tired. My glasses are so fucking dirty, I can't, like, see through them. So I'm, like, squinting. It's making my eyes sore. Ha! So much for stage trial number one. Whack. Ouch. What was that for? You had your eye on that monster from the start, didn't you? You knew Tella had problems with it, and you wanted to test your metal on it for yourself. Yeah, something like that. 
What now? Is this really the kind of thinking a sage would have, Palum? Of course. Maybe you should think a little more about how to use your magic. Well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Several more years later. Is this present day yet? Give me that goddamn present day! Oh, I think it is. Where did Palum run off to this time? Our trip to Mist, our first trip to Mist in years, and he decides to pull a no-show on me. Hmm. And now look who's here. Say Yang or Edward. I think they're both like working on doing shit. Hey, it's is that Sid? Is that a boy? Porum, that you? Yow, you've completely grown up on me, girl. Sorry to keep you waiting. Didn't mean to. Oh, not at all. I should be the one thanking you. Preparing an airship for us and everything. Actually, you're the one helping me out here. I just upgraded the Falcon, you see? It needed a test flight or two anyway. I suppose he's not coming. Hmm? No, it's nothing. Thanks again. So, we're headed for Mist? That's right. Oh, wait till you see Rydia. She's more beautiful than ever, you know? I'm sure she is. It's been quite a few years since we last met. Haha, -ha, you'd certainly give her a run for her money, though, Porum. Sid just creeping out on the fucking kids? Oh, Sid, don't flatter me like that. I mean, they're not kids anymore, but they were fucking kids a uh, game ago. I don't ever lie to women, Porum. That's the ever-loving truth. In that case, thank you very much. Ready to go, then, my dear? The Falcon's a dream to ride on now. The upgrade's really done the trick this time. When do I get to fly the ships? Not right now. Mm. Palum, what are you doing here? What? Am I supposed to report every little detail of my life to you? Ha, huh, can you believe this girl, Sid? Now, now, pal. You really ought to treat the women in your life better, you know, like I do. I would happily if the woman in question didn't spend all day giving me lip. How long has Palum been aboard the Falcon, Sid? He paid me a visit over in Baron, actually. What? Palum, you crossed the Devil's Road into Baron? Is there something wrong with that? You can't just go through the Devil's Road without telling anyone, Palum. What if something happened to you in there? Then what? Yeah, yeah, what are you, what are you my mother now? Hey now, I know you're a rebellious teenager and all, Palum, but come on. That has nothing to do with that. Haha, <laughs> so I guess the two of you are really grown up, aren't you? Uh, I bet Sid will let you steer if you sit on his lap. <laughs> Probably. Probably would. Alright, well let's save because we're in a completely different area here now. Just a second. I'm gonna BRB real quick. I just gotta clean my glasses, man. I can barely fucking see out of them. Just hold on a sec. I'm still I'm still here. I'm just, you know, cleaning my glasses. This is probably gonna make them worse. It'll just be like fucking everything will be lens flary. The worst when you clean your glasses with your shirt. <sighs> Can you hear me fucking breathing on me? All right, let's see. Is it worse? Nah, it's not worse. I don't know if it's better. All right. Did I save? I'm not sure if I saved. So yeah, I got one of those uh, PlayStation Classics, and I I kind of hacked it. I didn't have a lot of time. I only got like one game actually working on it though right now. So I'm looking forward to getting a bunch of games on there. Welcome to Mist, the village of summoners. Oh man, this is way better actually. We used to live cowering in fear of monsters, but that age is all but forgotten nowadays. Thanks to Rydia, Cecil, and that young man who sneaks in here sometimes, we couldn't feel more secure now. 
I bet that's uh, Kane. My boy, Kane. Wait, was Whip the last item? Yeah, it was. It's like Rydia type gear. How is your uh, your X Men? Uh, whoop. Fates. I heard you could learn some summoning magic through acquiring certain items. Really? That's pretty weird. Pretty fucking weird. Bomb crank? Bomb crank. Cool. I think that's like casting Fyra, basically. The grave in the north of town belongs to Rydia's mother. See what's going on at the inn, I guess. Absolutely nothing. There used to be a great many summoners in the world, but I fear the art has mostly been lost now. Here lies the motherly summoner who protected our village. Anybody in anybody in here? Oh nice. Oh, this is where Rydia lives? Sometimes. Rydia, how wonderful to see you again. Palum, Porum. Hey, don't forget about me, girl. You come here all the time, Sid. My goodness, you two are grown up now, aren't you? I'm glad to see you in good health, Rydia. How are you doing, Palum? Uh, okay. So what brings you here today? We just thought we'd pay you a visit since it's been so long. Well, thank you very much. Take your time here. It'll be lovely to have you. Sorry, Duke, I wasn't listening. Uh, n uh, um, <laughs> oh, my heart. Uh, yeah, I was just, uh, I was just asking uh, how you're doing and uh, how your Christmas went and if you got anything cool for X Men or Boxing Day. Uh, no big deal. It's not like I care about you or anything. I mean, <laughs> no big deal. Listen, I know we just got here, but I got a favor to ask. Huh? What's that? I want to go to the Fae Mark. What? I didn't realize you were interested in the Eidolons. It's for my training. You're trying to become a sage, aren't you? Well, I mean, I wouldn't say trying, but... Well then, maybe a quick a quick visit would be good for you. Pretty, huh? Are you sure? I haven't been back lately myself. Why don't we all go and take a look around? This is a job for the Falcon, then. Palum, this is why you came to see Sid in the first place, isn't it? About time you figured it out. Let's get ready to leave, then. You'll be joining us, right, Porum? I... I'm sure she'd rather stay here and hold down the fort. I'm going to... Ready to go, Sid? You got it. It'll be a snap with my new falcon. It doesn't look any different. Huh. Summoner Rydia has joined the party. Son of a bitch. There we go. Wait, let's check her house out. Maybe she's got some cool shit. Oh, like secret fireplace rooms. Silver hourglass, dry ether, and cottage. To the Falcon, the Millennium Falcon. Are you ready to head off? Oh, yeah, brother. Someday I'll be allowed to fly. Maybe. Possibly. Christmas was very good. It's all about the kitties when you have kids. And my sister and I both have kids. Nice. Did they get some uh, sweet gifts? And were they happy as F? Well, I have, I have one kid. That you know of. 
Sid, would you mind if we stop by the Dwarven Castle? No problem, my dear. I was just thinking about that myself. We'll get to see Luca again, Palum. I, uh, I'm not really looking forward to that. <laughs> oh, really now? I think he's got the hots for Luca, to be honest. What'd your uh, kid all get then? Some cool shit. Did you get her a uh, like a Ferrari or a Lamborghini? That's what all the kids are crazy about these days. Actually, kids are crazy about that slime shit for some reason. I don't understand it, but I'm sure my parents didn't understand the fact that I was into silly putty. So. When I was a kid, and it was just like it was just like one year where my sister and I were just like, I want silly putty. Princess Luke has been having a lot of fun lately. Sid, well, well, well. I haven't seen you in a dog's age, King Giot. How are you doing? I'm fit as a fiddle, Rydia, and who would this pair be? It's good to see you again, your highness. I'm Porum of Mycidia, and I'm Palum. My, how could I not have known? You've grown so much, both of you. Are they here? Luca! Palum and Porum, Sid too! She's got a bunch of toys. And a real guitar. Do you play guitar? It's great to see you, Luca. Uh, er, yo. Palum's just trying to play it cool. He's like, I want to dive deep into that dwarven pussy. You've managed to become a stylish little lady since I last saw you. Also, you have a face. Do you like it? I was never a fan of dwarven fashion, really. So what brings all of you here? Oh, she's got so much food replica toys, she's into that in the moment. Yeah, my, my niece is into uh, Shopkins. It's it's like little little food people, I guess. So I got her a Shopkins Jumbo Jet Baby. Um, but yeah, the one year we got her, uh, it was like fake spaghetti and like meatballs and shit. Uh, which is good. She was super into lols prior, and this, those are super expensive. What's lols? Well, we were hoping that Rydia could take us to the Feymark. It's part of my sage training. Is it now? Well, I appreciate you paying us a visit then. Feel free to stop by anytime you please. You are a family to every dwarf in the underworld. Uh, we'd better get going. What? You're leaving already? Kayla has, Kayla has a shitload of Shopkins. Yeah, so does my niece. So I was like, hey, you know what those little fuckers need? A jumbo jet, baby! What? You're leaving already? How rude of you, Palum. We just came to say hello, Porum. We'll come back soon, Luca. I'll go with you. Hey now, let's not get carried away. You don't mind, do you, father? I want to ride on Sid's airship. Luca, I don't want you getting in their way. Ah, interested in my airship, are you? I'd expect nothing less from the Dwarven Princess. So, it's okay? Sure, but only as far as the passage of the Eidolons, okay? Wahoo! Well, that's wonderful, Luca. I tell you, all this child talks about is you guys, and you wouldn't believe how she goes on about pal- Ah, hey, whoa! You don't know what you're talking about, father. Hey, settle down. I told you I don't want you causing any trouble. So she wants to smash as much as uh, Palin wants to smash. Dude, where the fuck? She's not even in the party. Just little toy dolls. They're 20 bucks a pop. They're like Shopkins. You gotta collect entire sets. Oh. What does LOLs stand for? Lots of uh, money. <laughs> Lots of l l money. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't know. Like Shopkins are kind of weird. Um, but the the whole toy food thing, like as far as like 
um, like fake pizza and stuff like that. I think every kid goes through that phase. You ready to head off? Actually, no. I should check the. I should check the store. Actually. That was me with, I had these, uh, like, Digimon toys, and of course on the back of the box it would show, like, all the other Digimon toys you could get, so I was like, I need all of them, ah. and my parents were like, oh, fuck, why did we get you one of them, even? Because now you want them all. Um, but I got, like, the one I got was the one that I really wanted, it was, uh... It was Vmon and Demi Vmon, Flame Dramon and Ray Dramon. So it was like all the the Vmon line. But then I wanted like the Agumon line and stuff. I don't even know where those ended up. I probably just like threw them in the trash or something. They weren't even like good quality toys really to be honest. Um I got lots of money. So whoa, that's expensive, but uh hey! We got some Gaia gear. And in a couple seconds here, I'll be uh, completely fucking broke. Just like that. Um, wizard cap, oh yes. There we go. I guess I could sell the stuff that I have and then not be so broke. But, uh, yeah. Did you end up picking up, uh, uh, Pokemon Let's Go? Also, how far are you in Dragon Quest XI now? Although, like, I mean, you've probably been, like, pretty gosh darn busy. Oh yeah, I got, uh, I got Spyro Reignited Trilogy from, uh, my grandma. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage was like the first PlayStation 2 game I ever had. And I like 100% completed that game. So I did play the first Spyro, but I've never like finished it. Like I just played like a little bit of the first one and I've never played the third one. So I was playing a bit of that this morning. So how have you been? Uh, okay. What are you being so shy for? Cause he wants dead pussy. Shut up, I am not. So you're really trying to become a sage? We're almost there, prepare for landing everyone. Luca, you come and help me. Okay. Alright, Luca, would you mind waiting here for us with Sid? Aw, how come? Don't you want me to come along, Porum and Palum? Uh, we're here for training, Luca. Though that's not all. Oh? Righto, we'll just run some maintenance on the Falcon while we're waiting. There's a few issues with the engine I gotta do something about. Okay. We'll be back soon. See you later. Sure thing, good luck. Hang in there, Palum. Okay, okay, already. It's like embarrassed. Like when little, like young kids, like teenagers have like a crush on someone and they're like, eh, don't talk to me. You're making my, okay, good. You're making my pimples agitated. Hi, potion. Fire. Fire arrows! Oh goodness. Oh, we're all in the back party? That's kind of kind of funny, actually. Um. Dude, she's got Bahamut and everybody. Um. Let's try a free. Why not? Just do an attack. Dude, we're still on the same moon cycle? That's, uh, pretty. Uh, I'm just gonna try fire. Uh, I don't know if that's actually. I think I'm thinking actually because of those gargoyles, it makes me think like thunder is the way to go. Oh, nice. Level get. 
Um, oh, I also, I, I bought for myself the, uh, Final Fantasy Ultimania, uh, archive, and it's, uh, pretty gosh darn cool, actually. I, I bought the first two volumes, so it's, uh, oh shit! I used Rydia's magic, I didn't mean to do that. Oh well, got the job done. Um, so it's got, like, all the information, like, even, like, the coding and stuff information for, like, the first... The, the Volume 1 has Final Fantasy 1 through 6, and then Volume 2 has 7, 8, and 9. So I've started reading Volume 1. But yeah, they've got, like, all the, all the information uh, for all the Final Fantasy games. It's really fucking cool, actually. Um, I didn't pick up Let's Go Eevee, I opted to get her more food toys. I figure I'll just pick it up come GST. I'm probably going to play it more than her anyways. Yeah, understandable. Collected six orbs and now traveling by myself. Hmm, I don't know if I remember that part. Like, you, you got, like, split up from the party? Uh-oh. The moon cycle changed. What did it do? Okay. Attack is up, and we don't use techniques anyways, so it doesn't matter. So when you say food toys, do you mean Shopkins, or do you mean, like, like, imitation, like, fucking, like, spaghetti and, like, stuff like that? Oh, shiza. Wow, these guys are expensive, and by expensive, I mean, like, lots of magic to cast. Uh, try not to spoil it, but something happened and now I'm by myself. Oh, well, you can spoil it. I beat the game, man. Oh, like the imitation toys? Okay. There's like, there's nothing to spoil, dude. I got the platinum trophy. Oh, nice. Um, sure, we'll save. Sure, why not? Can I go through this wall? Oh, I thought maybe. Just maybe. Son of a bitch. Wow, these guys, uh, are not, not good, actually. I really don't like fighting these guys. Um... We've got a uh, status fucker, we've got a one hit killer, and we've got uh, potentially another status fucker. I'm gonna use fire spells. I don't know why. Thinking about the masses of Dookie. There's no masses, dude. It's just you. <laughs> it's just you and me, man. There's no. It's nothing to be afraid of. And if they actually watch, if they if they watch my streams, they they watched me beat the game on stream. So NBD, brah. Can I pass through. I can kind of, but where the fuck? I can't move though. Okay, that's weird. Oh, tricky dicky. All right, I gotta start paying attention, man. I almost fucking died. <coughs> do, do. So what happened? Did you go through, uh... You got six orbs. Um, I don't want to guess because I might ruin it for you. <coughs> Did you go to the tree yet? Finny, Finny probably won't play Final Fantasy XI. Finny doesn't really play console games right now. What in the holiest of fucks did I just do? Oh, there we go. Yeah, baby. Hermes Sandals. Decoy. And Sage's Sir. Oh, that's a good thing, I think. Right? Yes! Ah, yes. Are, are you a... Uh, uh, are you under the water right now? I guess I should say. I'm trying not to ruin it for you. All right, I'm trying.
Ah, bitch! Wow, I gotta, like, actually heal outside of battle here, because these guys are doing quite a bit of damage. How about that twist, eh? You get the Yggdrasil, and you're like, I did it! I beat the game, man! It's Now let's go fight the boss and stuff. And then all of a sudden, you get Raffle pwned you get ripper Everyone's dead. What the fuck? Okay. Dude, that is not a good spell, by the way. What he's casting on us? It's like that bat spell. It's got the cobblestone and collecting my hero tags at the moment. Oh, are you is are you at the part where it's like cobblestone's like a base? Are you at that part? Oh my goodness, these guys, they don't stop. They don't stop coming, man. Uh... Yeah, oh, okay. Have the, how's, have the, are you just like talking to people right now? Or has anything, like, has shit gone down again yet? Or, I mean the bad guy is pretty much won at, at the point you're at. But it does get like worse and then it gets better. And by worse I mean like for the characters. I don't mean the game gets worse. The game only continues to get better. In fact, once you once the credits roll, then the game gets fucking absolutely incredible. Just talking and shit. Okay. Um. Uh. Bl Blizzara. I wonder if I should go back up there and like use a tent or something. Possibly a katog. Bam, bitch. Man, I haven't been able to like even go on Twitch lately. I've been so busy. Like usually I like watch other people stream and stuff. But I haven't even really been able to do that. I stopped by Epic Win Gaming's uh, stream the other night. But it was like right before I had to like drive somewhere. So I was just like, hey, <laughs> how's it going guys? And then just fucked off. I was like, I gotta go, but I'll drop you a host. All right, let's save. I should check where I am exp wise. Eight oh six. So I don't know how much exp I'm getting. So I I can't tell you if I'm level or not. To be honest. Oh, I changed the cycle. It weakens white magic. Okay. Come in. Oh, right. My mom got me. Uh, I I kind of like asked for Final Fantasy 13 because I don't have it. And you, Final Fantasy 13 you can't download, whereas like all its sequels you can download. And my mom, being pretty gosh darn cool, got me Final Fantasy 13. 13-2 and uh, uh, Lightning Returns. Probably because she was confused and was like, hey, he wants Final Fantasy for 13, but there's like three of them. <laughs> so I'll buy them all. What's this? The Eidolons. I can feel them. And then, yeah, for Boxing Day today, I got the PlayStation Classic. What's wrong? The training ends here. What? But we've come all the way down here and everything. Oh, is this fake? Is this fake? Fake, Rydia? Is there a problem, Rydia? The Eidolons are not fond of humans going into the Fame Arc. Plus, once you enter the Fame Arc, time starts to flow erratically. You mean... If you spend too long in the Fame Arc, you'll wind up out of sync with the human world and everyone you know. Are you willing to risk that? I am! Callum, 
If we go in for just a little bit, that won't put us too out of sync with human time, will it? I can't say. The two of you should wait here. Let me go with you. No, I'll be right back. Promise me that you won't follow me inside, okay? What if I say no? I'm gonna say no. Come on, we're practically there already. You can't, Palum, but thou must. I'll say no again. Okay. All right, we'll wait here for you. I'll be back as soon as I can. Sheesh, why'd, we, why'd she even bring us here if she's just gonna do this at the very end? Palum, why do you think Rydia brought us here in the first place? Why? Well, because... Hmm, good question, actually. She probably can get here by herself. Oh, maybe she wanted to test our hearts. Maybe. Whoa! Rydia! Sorry to keep you. Keep us? It was just a few seconds. Rydia? It's alright. Everything's fine. But... Palum, no. I'm sorry. We better get back to the Falcon. Sid and Luca are waiting for us. Son of a bitch! I don't know if, like, um. Shit, I meant summon. Let's go, Shiva. I don't know if, uh. If, like, Palum can actually, like, learn new spells while we're down here, or, like, by leveling up, or if it's, like, story-based, story-driven, I'm not too sure. It's confusing, because this chapter, right, so far, takes place before Palum's chapter. And I've already played Palum's, uh, chapter. Dude, we learned Teleport. Can we use it to GTFO? Oh, we actually can. Sweet! Good timing. Uh, let's use a tent, because why not? Oh, it's gonna fuck up the moon cycle, though. That's why not. Waxing moon. What do we got now? Probably black magic down. Damn! That sucks. Oh well. Let's save. Board the airship and hopefully we're not nerfed too bad. Oh, nice. Okay. I didn't have to use that tent at all. There you guys are. How'd it go? Great. Everyone's doing well. Get a lot of training done? Uh, yes, definitely. You bet we did. Well, guess what? I just made a big decision of my own. Huh? Luca is one talented girl, she is. She diagnosed an engine problem that not even I could figure out. I gotta hand it to the dwarves. The way they approach technology is like nothing I've seen before. So we talked for a while, and we decided that I'm gonna be Sid's apprentice. Really? That's great, Luca. Will King Giot let you? Way to spoil the mood, Palum. Are you ready to go? Yes! Take up your position, Luca. Aye, aye. She gonna fly this bitch. Present day. Oh, fucking finally, man. Guess you've arrived in Troya by now. And here I am, stuck in the city all by myself. Are you there, Porum? How are you feeling, Elder? Oh, no worries, I feel fine today. That's wonderful. What bothers you, my child? Nothing. You wanted to travel to Troya instead of Palum, am I right? 
I don't know anymore. Are you worried about Pelham? Well... You want to go off on your own, do you not? Just like Pelham? Elder. Pelham is a rare talent. There's little denying that, but he's still young. That's why I sent him on this business. There is much for Pelham to learn through teaching others. I see. You're worried, aren't you? Worried that Pelham will leave you behind someday? Perhaps. You two have been together your entire lives, as siblings, as friends, and as rivals. But more importantly, when you look at each other, you see yourselves. Yes, you're right. I'm sure you'll find your own path to walk sooner or later, Porum. The best thing to do now is to think about what that path might be. Yes, Elder. There's no need to rush yourself. Ah. Uh. What is it, Elder? The dragon. It's crying. What? Oh, right. She's, like, trying to... This chapter is all about like the lunar whale. The lunar whale. I have called all of you here to discuss a dire matter. The lunar whale has risen, setting off in the direction of the moon. With Palum absent, I would like to call upon the powers of the dragoon. The dragoon? You mean Cain? The one and only, if the rumors are to be believed, we can find him on Mount Ordeals. But... But what? I heard that Cain had severed all ties with Baron. Elder, this is certainly a serious matter that requires swift response. But surely, Mycidia's army of mages would be sufficient for its protection. Even if those dreadful events of the past were to visit us again... Oh, that's fucking the ninja. See the toad in the bottom corner? Remember when I was playing through that ninja's chapter? And the ninja was, like, hiding and spying? Black magic is not a panacea for all our problems. Have you forgotten what the Elder taught us? But how else should we respond to the moon's return? Elder? I'll travel the mount ordeals at once. But, don't worry, I won't do anything rash. Be careful out there. Whatever you do, remember to stay out of harm's way. Yes, Elder. <laughs> Listen, everyone, we cannot afford to hurry ourselves into an ill-advised plan of action. Yes, Elder. I want you two to go with Porum. Yes, Elder. Oh, nice, okay. Uh, sure. Uh, sh sure. Lightning arrows. Uh, let's go with fire arrows. Pretty much everything's, like, undead there, if I remember correctly, so... Psycho Spiral, cast Confused when used as an item. Ah, Great Bow. Ooh, Holy Arrows, even better against the undead. Um, oh, it's not as powerful. That's alright. All oh, right, we're, I was gonna check the uh, armor shop. Wizard's hat, sage's miter. What the hell? I like grabbed on those in my earlier cave. Let's have all those other things. Uh, this would be good to have, but I don't have any goddamn. Uh, uh wait, I could probably sell some stuff, like lightning arrows, for example. And healing staff, and crossbow, and flame rod, and this thing. Ya yeah, dude. Now we can afford the shit.
but only one the shit. Now I should be able to sell the wizard's hat. And it's not gonna be enough. Can these guys equip the wizard's hat? There we go, okay. Um, our stats are all fully healed and shit. What about for items? Not bad. Alright, let's save. And head to Mount Ordeals. I imagine uh, her chapter will end after we get to Mount Ordeals. Son of a bitch. Ooh, black magic down. Not cool, man. Not cool. White magic is up. Uh, just attack, I guess? I don't fucking know. Dead. Those fucking goblin guys die in one hit, like, pretty much no matter what, so... These guys definitely... That black mage definitely isn't as powerful as, uh... Wow! They hate that white mage. As, uh... What's her name? Or, uh... As Palom. Heal yourself, bitch! That was a bit overkill, I would say. All right. Doma boy. Um. Yeah, let's just go with Thundara, I guess. Damn! If she would have hit, she would have killed it because these things are like the first monster you encounter in Final Fantasy One, so. Shouldn't be much of a big deal to take out. Fucking encounter rate. Dude. I should have maybe dog piled on that guy, but it will. Oh, it killed him anyways. Cool. Cool. Ba 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 ba. Dead. Dude, I think I'm going the wrong way. Oh, maybe not. I can't remember if Mount Ordeals is the one that you used to like travel, you have to like travel through to get somewhere, or if it's the one that's like in the middle of uh, that forested area. Uh, shit. Let's attack uh, that guy. I think the black mage should be able to kill them all in one hit anyways. A die, bitch! Oh yeah, they are dunskies. I'm just trying to like, you know, get someone to fucking gain a level, but... I don't know, maybe, maybe that's not gonna happen. Dead. Alright, well this is the mountain in the middle of the thing. Is that Mount Ordeals? Oh, it is. Cool. Alright, well let's save outside. I'm gonna grab another beer. So I will a beer right back. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Alright, alright. Be right back. Where'd my mouse go? Oh, there it is.
Alright, I'm back, baby. Let's get this motherfucker fucking done deed. Good old scone of gold. Not that great of a beer, but it's gotta be drank, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's fucking do the thing. Let's go get us a cane. Let's go catch us a cane. Gotta love that run button though, man. That's that's a fucking selling feature. If you ask me. Okay, um, fire, please. Uh, normally, like, regular fire, I would say, would do it, but, uh... Wow, that's pretty strong, man. But because fire is nerfed right, or uh, magic is nerfed right now, we're gonna use fire. -a. How's that sound? See, here's the thing. There should be ninja gear in that tre treasure chest. Because that's what there was when I came through as the fucking ninja earlier. Come on, Black Mage. Dude, why does Black Mage have shit for MP? That's what I'd like to know. White Mage gained a level. Black Mage gained a level. Like, they just don't have names. It's just White Mage and Black Mage. It's terrible, man. Fire! Wow. Dude, all this talk of Final Fantasy XI makes me want to play Final Fantasy XI. Oh, that son of a bitch. Oh, nice. 13 fucking... Oh, nice, she learned to see 13 hit points away from fucking... Death. Alright, we got some ethers, so let's use a couple of those. Psycho Spiral. What in the fuck is that? Oh, that's right. That was in the item shop. Um, let's uh, give it to her, actually. Or, I guess, I don't know. Is the white mage a girl? Who knows? You can't see uh, his and or her face. So. It is weird that there's items in there that aren't, you know. Okay, I don't like fighting those guys because they heal from fire magic. Half them, like, take double damage and half heal from fire magic, so it's just an annoying situation to be in, in my opinion. Whatever, we'll try it. I'm gonna... Oh, uh, wait, let's, let's use, uh, just Cure on everyone. And let's shoot that fucking thing. Nice! Now we don't have to worry about it getting healed. This, uh, this beer's not gross, but it's not good, man. I love Alley Cat's Apricot beer, but their Scone of Gold is not very good. Sage's Mitre. Uh, we should actually honestly give it to him. He's, like, doing all the damage right now. Yeah, I don't want to fight these guys. No, 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 no. I was like, I just about bit, um, on a, on a Boxing Day sale for the, uh, Switch, but, like, I knew I wasn't gonna play it, so I just didn't, I just didn't buy it, and a PlayStation Classic is just way cheaper, plus I had, like, a, like, a $50 gift card or whatever for Best Buy, so... And once I get the thing properly, like, hacked, then, uh, it's essentially, it's essentially, like, an infinite free games, so. But yeah, so far the only game I have working 100% on there is, um, Bushido Blade 2, which is the main reason I wanted to, wanted to, like, hack it in the first place. The main reason I wanted to get one, honestly. 
I've, I've played it like on my Wii because I have like my Wii hacks, but the controls just are weird on the Wii. They're not the same as using like an actual PlayStation controller. Oh my god, that's where I came from, okay. Ah yes, the beautiful save point. Um, let's use the cottage because we're probably just about done this chapter. I, I would assume once I get to the top here, I'll be done this chapter. Alright, save! Boss fight? So the ninja was following her this hallway, and then something happened here. What's that? Cause, Cause she like disappeared. I don't feel anything. Ah! I can hear something. It's fading fast, like it could disappear at any moment. It's a voice. One I feel I've known before. Oh shit! What? Where are we? What a mess. Wait, could this be the place where King Cecil of Baron became a paladin? And the place where Sage Tella learned the forbidden meteor magic as well. Oh gentle white mage. I am about to fade, but my spirit will never be extinguished. My sons have always believed in you, and now... That voice! Cecil's father. And father to all, all we who study magic. What the fuck? Oh, dead ace. Okay, um, I guess fire. Uh, uh, hit them, I guess. Dead. Oh, that didn't. That sucked, actually. Black Mage is a lot weaker than fucking Horum. Dude, he got silence cast on him. Let's just get the fuck out of here. So when that ninja showed up, I was probably in like the shadow realm. What the hell is this guy? Oh shit! It's a fuckload of zombies and fucking skeletons and shit. And they all get first attack because we got ambushed slash back attack slash actually just back attack because ambushed is an entirely different thing. Look at all of them, we're hopelessly outnumbered. Hey, it's my boy! Kane, motherfucker! Kane! What? The Dragoon from Baron, the one that Cecil and his group trusted. Have I seen you before? I'm Porum, White Mage of Mysidia. A white mage. Do you remember me? I came here to find you by order of our elder. To find me? What for? I see. At this rate, Baron could be in danger soon as well. But tell me, what reason do I have to help you? What? Baron ceased to be a part of my life a very long time ago. That can't be true. Pardon? You're lying. You're lying to me and to yourself. Am I wrong? No. Then please, let's go. Baron awaits. Dragoon Kane has joined the party. All right, that's cool. Let's save. Dude, how freaking long is her chapter? It's already been like an hour and a half. Pro possibly more, even, because there's like all that prequel shit. In between quill. No, 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 not a chance. 
damn it, dude. What's with all these fucking back attacks and shit? Kane is just super fast. Um, I don't know. Blizzara, I guess. Let's uh, just cast it on that guy. Nice, dude. He's just fucking hella OP. No big deal. NBD, bruh. That was weak as fuck. Oh, right. That's her counter. Shit. I need to watch out for that. She counters magic. Or, uh, sorry, counters regular attacks with that potentially paralyzing attack. Or, uh, it can, like, paralyze or it can silence. Both of which are pretty fucking terrible status effects to have. Preemptive strike. Let's just kill that guy. And then you kill that guy. And then let's cast Fyra on those guys. And you kill that guy. And... Ah! Oh, oh well. It doesn't matter. It's not like I did any damage to this guy yet. So he's just gonna die this turn. Dunskis. Alright. Oh, what's gonna happen? What's going on? What? Palum! We need to go. I know, I heard his voice. Uh oh. Spaghettios! Nice! Black magic, fire up, die, motherfuckers. Alright, if he's not dead, well, he'll be dead, but I don't know if that top left guy will be dead. Oh yeah, they're dead. White mage and black mage gained a level. Those are the real main characters of this game, by the way. White mage and black mage. does weak ass damage when he's attacking like the the back party makes sense eat a dick zombos dead oh yeah black mage jeez fucking long does it take to cast a spell black magic up attack down Forum's about to level. Like, are we actually gonna have to go all the way to, uh... Fucking, um... Oh no! I fucked that up. Are we actually gonna have to go all the way to, uh... Fucking, uh... Baron? Or... What? Do the whole like devil's trail thing. Alright, we needed us a ma a mafkin chocobo. Um Kira, everybody. Catch him. Gotta catch him all, chocobo. Do 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 No encounters now, biatch! Alright, let's save. We made it all the way here. And all that jazz. With a living, breathing cane at our side. Oh, shit! What? No! Cane! We're too late. We have to find the Elder quickly! Uh, are you the Elder? Obsidia, the crystal, they must be saved! Can we kill these guys? Oh yeah, we can. Oh shit, there's like a whole bunch of them. Dead? No, not dead. I know like, thunder heals them, but I'm not sure. Let's use uh, Blizzara, I guess. Uh, let's use uh, just Cure. 
just a uh, cure. Fucking die, Plops. Dude, I shouldn't have done that. I should have attacked someone else. That was a terrible fucking move on my part. Yeah, I should have attacked that other guy. Oh no, now she's got snot falling out of her nose. What was that, slow or stop? Dead! Just kidding, but now, now for real. He's dead. Or I'm gained a level. Alright, is she still status fucked? Because that would suck. Nope, she's good. Alright, um... Goblin captains? Not a chance! Dude, goblins are weak as fuck. Dead. Oh, man. Dead. Alright, well, the magic will kill him, okay? Don't make a liar out of me, game. There we go. Holy shit! That was some good EXP, dude. Leave this to us, Forum. Get to the Hall of Prayer. More like get to the inn of... Inn. I never thought I'd see the, the battles and the hard times return in my lifetime. I wonder if the sexy dancer will still dance. Can we use the inn? 200 bucks? Pretty outrageous, but uh... <laughs> why not? Who is this? They say some really nasty monsters show up in the northeastern lands when the moon is showing its bottom half. If you're going outside during a waxing moon, you better be ready for the worst. Look, bitch, we're under attack right now. You're not even, like, mentioning it. That's bad NPC-ness right there. N N P C ness Steel Golem! Oh yeah, brother! Oh no, what? Put to sleep? What is this nonsense? Um, how about Asuna? How about... What are you doing? How about... Oh, he's dead. How about Ray's? Now Asuna was a waste. Dude, we might get, uh... What the French call lay fucked in this battle. I should have used jump. As soon as a fucking waste. Uh, all right, jump is weakened. God damn motherfucker, you piece of fucking cock shit. Okay, why is this guy so strong? Let's use uh, Kira. Also, he gets a turn like every 15 seconds, it seems. So that's cool. I... 418... 527... Insta-dead. Um, let's just try and keep... Uh, uh, Kane alive. Oh my god. This is bad, dude. Let's use... Uh... Oh, he's dead! Whew! Okay. We're okay, guys. I knew. I knew he was. <laughs> Easy. Fucking peasy. Lemon squeezy, alright? That was fucking... Wasn't worried for a second. Alright, we're fully healed. Everything's good to go. Hold on. Hang in there. What's that guy's name? Black Mage 2? Porum, the Elder... Let's go. Crystal Chamber. Oh, Crystal's still here. Well, that's good. That's a good sign. Oh, shit. They killed him! Son of a bitch. You will pay for this, you blood eyes, son of a bitch. Wow. Wow, that hurt. Okay, ow, okay, okay, okay. Let's try Thundara, because he's flying? I don't know. Let's use Kira on yourself. Let's use attack. And I hope I can take this fucker down. Let's 
see what that Thundara does. Oh, what does that do? What? No! Dude, as long as she doesn't heal him, we'll be okay. If she just... Oh, she's healing him. She's doing something. Um, let's use, uh, Isuna on her. Let's use, uh, Thundara on that guy. Let's use Attack. Dude, is he just gonna confuse everybody? Because that's pretty shitty. Especially since the White Mage has a stick that if, if, if you get hit by it, it can confuse you. So not, not cool, man. Um, let's use Kira on everyone. How about... She did! God damn it, man. Everyone does high-ass damage at this point in the game for some reason. I really just want to honestly just keep Kane alive. Uh, so let's just keep using Kira. Oh, good. He's dead. Hopefully this chapter's over, because goddamn. 3,000 gil, 2,000 EXP. Alright, is it over? Elder! Elder! He dead, man. He dead. Not cool. Oh, he's alive! Okay, we're good. Porum, you've returned safely. Elder. The monsters, they appeared from the Devil's Road. And Baron's already been overrun. I fear it is already too late. No, it can't be. Where is Cain? Right here. We stand below the Twin Moons once more. As we speak, your homeland of Baron has fallen into the hands of monsters. And next, Mysidia. They're after the crystals. So it appears. Who could be sending them here? I cannot say. I need to see Baron for myself. Elder, I too will go to Baron. Don't. Cain? What are you... Where are you going? Baron is my homeland. So the design of Cain in this game, like the hooded man, who I'm pretty sure is Cain, um, in the uh, Final Fantasy Ultimania uh, archives or whatever book I have, that was actually one of the original designs for Kane. Was was that look? So, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's Kane. Anyways, you don't need to worry about me, Porum. Just just promise me you won't do anything rash. Our magical seal broken as if it were nothing. What on earth are we dealing with? Hold on, can I crawl through bed and talk to the white mage? <laughs> that's funny. Don't worry, I'll give the elder the best care there is. Okay. Ah! Oh shit. Who are you? Even if I told you, you wouldn't comprehend it. You're the one who unsealed the Devil's Road, aren't you? Yes. To retrieve the crystal. Retrieve? Yes. Hold it, you! Oh, it's the Elder. Oh shit, he gon' die. Those who lust for power must never lay hands on the crystal. Never again! I don't need your permission. He's fucking dead as shit, I'm pretty sure. Also, Porum's dead as shit, so, uh, yeah, not cool. Not cool, man. Dude, all he knows is white magic? The fuck is this? Um, let's use Float, I guess, on everyone, just in case. Maybe she'll summon Titan, who knows? Die, bitch! I mean, everybody loses against her, so, uh... Yeah, not, not looking too hopeful here. But, I mean, maybe. Dude, if Porum could kill her, that would be pretty, uh... Pretty OP, I would say. 
Okay, what else do we got? We got the uh, mini. Dude, if we can mini her, I know we can't though. Um, I can't believe this guy doesn't know any offensive magic whatsoever. Um, let's cast Shell. I guess he's not a sage. But where the fuck did Pol Palum learn learn his uh, offensive magic, like his black magic? Then, oh no, not Rama. Rama, why are you doing this? Uh, protect as well. Uh, let's uh, keep attacking her, I guess. I don't know. I'm pretty sure this is one of those gonna lose no matter what fights. So let's just lose no matter what. I wonder, like in these fights, if you were to like kill yourself, what would happen? Like I've always kind of wondered that in the you're supposed to lose anyway fights. No. Elder! What is he casting? Hold? Oh, what? Oh, he cast like teleport. Judgment bolt time, bitch. By the way, folks, if you haven't yet, please give me a follow here on twitch.tv slash dukey03. Click that heart. Show me some love. I'd appreciate the hell out of it. You can also uh, check out my past streams on youtube.com slash dukey03. Like and follow me on Facebook to be notified of what and when I'll be streaming next. Facebook.com slash Duke03. But the best place, of course, to stay in touch would be the Discord. I posted a link to that and all the others in the chat. Click those links. I would appreciate the hell out of it. Um, Yeah, my next stream is going to be tomorrow, pretty much off and on all day throughout the day. So starting at about 10 or 10.30 a.m. Central Standard Time. Elder, no! How meaningless. You! Wait! Kane! Is this what you're looking for? Oh, he stole the crystal. That is it. The real thing. It's yours. Wait, Kane! A wise choice. On one condition, though. What? I'll give it to you only after I finish what I set out to do. And what is that? An audience with the King of Baron. For what purpose? To take his life. I'll kill Cecil with my own hands. Understood. Bring the crystal with you. Kane! Is he dead? Elder... Palum... Palum! She gotta find Palum. Alright, chapter complete! Oh, sweet. Yeah, dude, I should be on a uh, good chunk of the old day. Porum's Tale, the Vanished Lunar Whale. Dude, that had nothing to do with the Lunar Whale. I don't know why it was even called that. Save, Plocks. Alright, well, that was her story. What do we have left here? Do, 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 do. Edward and then Kane. I think I'm gonna skip Edward's tale and just jump to Kane's. Aided by his neighbors, Edward has nursed the kingdom of Dampsey and back to health. One night he witnessed a meteor strike within his castle's windows. After a barren emissary orders Edward not to touch the crash site, the king travels to Cecil's domain with his secretary Harley in search of an explanation. Yeah, let's uh, maybe just jump to Kane's. Kane returns at last from Mount Ordeals, only to besiege Baron Castle, bearing Mercedes' water crystal in hand and accompanied by a mysterious girl. What can his dark mutterings about killing Cecil really mean, and what has happened to Cecil, Rosa, and Theodore? When they all meet again in Baron, the fate of their small blue planet will begin to change forever. Yeah, so this is like a direct sequel to Porum's Tale, so yeah, let's fuck, fuck it. Edward sucks anyways, so let's just skip to Kane's Tale. Oh, so now I can use, uh, yeah. 
You can play this story using your clear data from certain stories you've completed. Would you like to load your clear data? Uh, fuck yeah. Oh, Theodore's tale. Okay. Sounds good to me. Oh, so this is gonna like continue his his tale. Start. Stop, bitch. All right, what does he have? Oh, he's level 30. Fantastic. So do I have all the gear from, like, Theodore's quest? Maybe? Am I supposed to leave or... You know what, let's just go to the top because we're almost there anyway. It's gonna be tough though because it's just one guy. Like, these guys aren't hard, but it's the fact that I have to like wait my turn every single time. Dead, bitch! Da -da 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 -da. Let's level up! Oh shit. And then shit like this happens where they all three get an attack before I even get a chance to do anything. Oh man, he's back party as well. I should be able to still one hit kill everything ever. I'm just gonna use jump on the snake thing. Just to make sure it dies. Dead bitch! Wow, that's fucking strong. What I was trying to do before I got the encounter was see, wow, he needs a lot of EXP. Alright, anything going on here? Fuck! An ogre? By the way, Faith, did you ever end up downloading that uh, Final Fantasy Brave X Xvius on, on, like, smartphone? This monument, why is something like this here? Uh, it's pretty pretty sweet game and uh, you can add me as a friend and then you can use my yang my character yang in that game he's pretty fucking uh, OP he's got like over 500 attack damage which is pretty high for that game Mithril armor. Like, there's always, like, something different in these chests, depending on who you're playing as. Oh, he's already got Mithril armor. When I was playing as a ninja, it was all ninja gear. Now it's, like, armor. When I was fucking Porum, it was, like, mage equipment. Doesn't make any goddamn sense. What you up to, by the way, Fates? Watch a dern. Antarctic ass. I had it before but never played it. Oh, it's pretty, uh, pretty decent. I just skip all the cutscenes and just play the game. I have, like, a pretty damn good team of characters that I actually like right now, so maybe that's just why I'm enjoying it so much. Like, I have Zidane from Final Fantasy IX. I've got uh, Paladin Cecil, I've got uh, Yang, I've got um, Vivi, and my, and then I got Prompto. Six star Prompto, bitch. I can get seven star Prompto if I get another six star Prompto. Playing, oh, you're playing Dragon Quest XI right now, okay, cool. What'd you think of that whole fish part? That was pretty, pretty weird, hey? Like, it was kind of cool, but it was like, out of fucking nowhere, man. Out of fucking nowhere. Are you liking Dragon Quest XI? Are you liking it as much and or more than you thought you would?
Like, I I still don't know if I like it more than 7. Like, ah, man. The thing about 7 is, like, it's so long that I don't really want to replay it. But I could replay the, the 3DS version, because the 3DS version was actually shorter than Dragon Quest XI. Can't leave this mountain. Not yet. You. Oh. Who's there? There's someone else here besides me. Yeah, it's fucking really good. Do I go all the way back up again? Oh well, I got all the treasure now, so I don't need to worry about that. And it's not like these guys are like presenting any challenge or anything. Yeah, it's a fucking incredible game, dude. So wait till you get to the... Like, here's the thing. I keep calling it post-game because it's after the credits. But it's honestly mandatory, so I don't know why it, it's post-game. Jade is my new game crush. That's funny. What about... Did you meet Crystalinda yet? That chick's a fucking babe, dude. That's definitely the hottest Dragon Quest character slash any video game character of all time, I would say. But Jade's pretty cool. Um, who's your, like, main party when you have everybody? Back before everyone died. I always used, uh, who did I use? Oh, hold on. Dragoon. I wonder if it's like Dark Knight Cecil. I'm sure I heard it. It was faint, but there was definitely a voice. Um, I used uh, Hero, Eric, um, Silvando, and Rab, I believe. That was my main. But the thing is, with that game, is, is I fucking loved every character, so it was like, it was really hard for me to like stick to one party. The only character I didn't really like was, like, um, like, Veronica, maybe? Oh, you used Veronica. Hero, Jade, Eric, and Veronica. Yeah, I didn't like Serena or Veronica, really, all that much. But, Eric is, uh, pretty awesome, and Sylvando is pretty fucking awesome. And Rab is pretty fucking awesome. Swapped Eric for Serena in boss fights. Do you have, uh, do you have, like, dual boomerangs on him yet? You can get, like, the pentarang and shit from, uh, Dragon Quest IX in that game, but I don't think you get it till, like, the post game. It's just in, like, treasure chests in the post game, I think. But maybe not. Maybe you can get it before the post game. I don't remember. Oh, I should probably save here. His, a lot of his dual knife attacks are really fucking strong too, hey? Yeah, I like all the characters, man. Like, I mean, not so much. Like, Serena and Veronica are definitely the probably the weakest in my opinion, but they're all very, like, likable, especially by the end of the game. Do a boomerang right away. Yeah, it's awesome. You can get um, a, an ability that makes. Oh, what is it? I can't remember what it's called, but it makes both his left and right arm equally strong. You will. So, like, you know how his. Whatever the weapons in his left hand is, like, way weaker than his right one? Or maybe Eric's left-handed, but you know what I mean. Like, his dominant hand is always, like, way weaker. Is it coming from this monument? But you do get one that makes both hands equally as strong. You, too, will... Oh, shit. From here? What's gonna happen, man? You, too, will... Intense pain. Just as my did before 
What? Oh, this is obviously Cecil's dad. The end of... Dude, you're cutting out. Who are you? I am... Who are you? I am you! And <laughs> it actually is him. Did you ever watch, uh... Did you ever watch, uh, Mad TV? <laughs> Back in the day? Will Sasso did a... Um... Arnold Schwarzenegger <laughs> spoof The Return of the Dragoon What happened? Ah My guess is that is a uh, uh porn Screaming Shit I need to hit that spot Oh yeah, it is. A white mage! I like how he just jumps everywhere, because, you know, he's a dragoon, so jump. Look at all of them, we're hopelessly outnumbered! Dead bitch! How can he do that move? I need to, I need to use that move. That made up bullshit move he just used. Kane! Have we met before? I'm Porum, white mage of Mysidia. Oh, nice, it's skipping here. Is this what you're looking for? suck a my dick This was it. The, this is it. The real thing. It's yours. Wait, Kane! A wise choice. On one condition, though. What? I'll give it to you only after I finish what I set out to do. And what is that? An audience with the King of Baron. For what purpose? To take his life. I'll kill Cis Cecil with my own hands. Understood. Bring the crystal with you. Cain! Peace out, bitch! <laughs> it just fucking hops across town. Ah, oh, the Devil's Road. This was a fucking mazy place. Who are you, anyway? All in due time. Burp. Maybe I can follow her and then it won't be so mazy. Nope. It gonna be mazy. Ah. Oh, cool. No, no floor damage. Well, that's pretty tits. What happened to Cecil? As the King of Baron, he's perfectly fine. Don't lie to me, bitch! Ah, oh, you fucking centaur! He walks around with no shirt on. He's a centaur. He's famous. Easiest way would be for you to lie face down. He's built... He's a man, but he's built like a horse from the waist down. A little, a little buck sixty-five for you there, kids. Gremlins? I've actually honestly never seen those monsters before. They must be new to the after years. Come on, Kane, you were way faster in form story. Dead. Fucking, look at that EXP, though. High pot. It's like taking away the mazy elements, and I like it. There's no wrong paths available to me. Mithril Helm, Zeus's Wrath. I think I have a Mithril Helm, right? Yarp! Oh shit! I'm getting back attacked by a centaur. Fucking bestiality shit. Alright, we need to run. Tell me one thing at least. Why are you collecting the crystals? There's no need for you to know. Maybe she's a good guy the whole time. Like, probably not, but maybe. Do, 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 do. 
Where do we go? Where are we going, boy? Where are we going? No! Fuck! The only time I'm given an option, and it takes me all the way back to the start. I just wanted fucking treasure, okay? Nice, preemptive strike. Give me that free. Free XP! Are you using that sexy sword of darkness? It's pretty cool that you get that. Oh, so wheat. Decoy, alright. A black knight. You ever see... Remember when, like, Martin Lawrence was, like, the fucking king of comedy? And there was a movie, I think, called Black Knight, and I always wanted to see it, and I never did. But he was, uh... What was he on? Like, Bad Boys, and, like... I don't know what else he was on, but I just remember being a... I just loved Martin Lawrence when I was like, when I was like a teenager, and I always wanted to see that Black Knight movie. Cause he was just like some dude from like New York or some shit that got transported back to like medieval times. And I thought it was, I thought it would have been a pretty goddamn good show. All right, Encounter Eight, you can suck a dick. But, uh, by the way, Fates, the encounter rate does work the same as, as the Final Fantasy IV, uh, as Final Fantasy IV does, at least in the PSP version. Like, if you're, like, insanely overleveled, the encounter rate vastly drops, but if you're underleveled, then, uh, bad news bears. I wanted to see it, but never watched it. Yeah! Dude. Fuck. I, I really want to check, like, the terms... Yeah, he was in it. He was so good. Name some of the shows, because I don't even remember, like, what shows he was in. But I just remember loving the shit out of Martin Lawrence when I was a teenager. And who are you? A Dragoon. Ex-Baron. I see. Yeah, I just remember loving the shit out of him, man. I, I want to check Twitch's, like, terms of service and see if you can, like, if you can live stream a movie and just, like, visit with your friends through chat. And then one night we should just fucking watch Black Knight <laughs> on, on the stream and then, and then go to jail, probably. Like, I don't know what would happen. Like, I don't want to get banned. I don't know how that works. Ooh, this, this is, like... I remember this. Forward, please. There we go. Forward. And that's a block. And that way. And down. Don't fuck me. We're good. And down. Oh, dude. We're getting it first try. And by first try, I mean, like, we did this before. So, you know. Did this in the prequel, a.k.a. Final Fantasy IV. King gained a level! Oh, fuck yeah. Alright, please work, please work. Please work. Actually, you know what? Fuck it, this one has higher probability of working. There we go. Other streamers use a different site for watching movies. Oh, really? What site do they use? So it is probably illegal as fuck. I saw a man with Prince Theodore. I've seen him somewhere before, I'm sure of it. You look like a dragoon in that outfit. Are you going to some kind of party? As if nobody remembers Kane. The regular route to Kai Po isn't running right now, it seems. I haven't seen even a glimpse of the castle guard ever since those monsters attacked the castle. The Red Wings are conducting flights over town all morning, noon, and night. It's some kind of training, perhaps? Maybe you can watch a movie if you pretend you're playing the video game version of that. Dude! Somebody did that with a UFC pay-per-view. They pretended they were playing, because it was when UFC 2 first came out, like the game, 
and they were pretending they were playing UFC 2 and they like they like live streamed an entire UFC pay-per-view pretending that they were playing the game and they got away with it 100% Sid hasn't come back home in a long time I heard King Cecil and Queen Rosa haven't paid a visit to town to the town lately uh I looked I looked it up a couple of months ago but I can't remember the sites oh there was a couple sites oh Phoenix Dern. High Passion. All right, I think that's it. Just, just basically, just Pornhub, probably. Let's stream. Pay me, pay me gold on Pornhub, and I'll, uh, we can watch uh, some Martin Lawrence comedies together. <laughs> Might even take my uh, <laughs> panties off. Oh, that was a little, uh, a touch barfy, NBD. I mean, not that I know what <laughs> paying in gold means on Pornhub. They sealed off the entrance to the ancient waterway. It's too dangerous to go poking around in there. Whoa, that armor looks like some kind of legendary Dragoon outfit. Where'd you buy that gear? It's actually, a uh, mithril armor, as you can see. <laughs> All right, let's save, go to the castle, and whip some butts. No one may pass, orders from the king. Let him in. Oh, it's the fucking, that chick. Raw. Baron Castle, first floor. Oh, let's get some fucking sexy ass treasure. Red Fang, X Potion, Remedy. What the fuck's Red Fang? Oh, it's just a tooth from a fire breathing dragon. Oh my god, that's so cool. Okay. Ah, a cut. I could use a cottage. Dude, we need to organize this shit. There we go. Let's, uh, tent it up, baby. Oh, no, I shouldn't have tented. It's gonna change the fucking moon. God damn it. That was a terrible idea. What are we at now? Oh, it's magic. Who cares? Ain't nobody gives a fuck about magic. Your orders, my liege. The door is broken and won't budge. God damn it. Your orders, my liege. Phoenix down, bronze hourglass. Like, how many times have I gotten this treasure? Wow, what did I get? I don't even know what I got. I don't know. Probably like a remedy or something. Your orders, my liege. You fucker. Okay. Oh, goddammit. Hermes sandals. Hi. <laughs> Potion. Oh, I gotta like read the things. I'm expecting to like not get anything, so I just mash the button. That's the problem. What's White Fang if Red Fang is a dragon? Is White Fang like just a different dragon? An ice breathing dragon. Oh, as opposed to a fire breathing dragon. A uh, cool! All right, let's uh, let's uh, GTFO, kids. All right, let's uh, go fuck up our old pal Cecil, Cecil McGavin. Just kidding, that's not his name. I don't remember. It. Oh, Cecil Harvey, and Kane Highwind. That's why Sid in Final Fantasy VII is a reference to. Uh, the Dragoons, like Cecil Highwind, or like Kane Highwind. Also, uh, oh, what's her name? Aranea, I think, Highwind from Final Fantasy XV, who was also a Dragoon. 
Cecil's in here. I know. Let me ask you again. What do you plan to do when you see Cecil? Nothing has changed. Cecil will die by my hands. I see. Why is my nose always plugged? Throne room. Ooh. He's not even in here. What the fuck? He stood me up. Where is he? First, I wish to test your resolve. I've told you already I intend to kill him. But can you? Of course. Give me your crystal. No, I fucking told you. I will. Once my business is done as agreed upon. The crystal's that important to you? You can crush the thing to pieces for all I care. All that matters to me is putting an end to Cecil's life. Why do you hate him so much? That's none of your concern. Then you won't mind getting two more crystals for me. What? Do that and I'll arrange an audience with Cecil for you. Fine. I still need the wind and fire crystals. Then I head for Fabul and Damsian. I will lend you an airship and a company of soldiers. Fair enough. Oh, do you think he's gonna bang that chick? We are ready for you outside, sir. Your orders, my liege. Your orders, my liege. Ah, we are robots! I think they're robots. Alright. Save. Oh, she somehow, like, fully healed. Oh no, I used the tent. Now I remember. <laughs> Kane's story is the real story, kids. I think the only, like, mandatory ones are, like, Kane and Theodore's, to be honest. Are you ready to depart, sir? <gasps> the kid. Meanwhile. Meanwhile, at the Hall of the Super Best Friends. I heard that the path ahead has been blocked since the mountain caved in. You heard that over in Baron? So that's not Kane? Yes, but... Because if this is meanwhile, that means it's happening at the same fucking time, right? Perfect, we'll proceed due east from the village. Wait a minute. So maybe that's not... Maybe that's Edward. His hair is the same as Edward. So maybe the hooded man is actually Edward. Mist Cliff. I don't remember that. Wow, the mountains collapsed into a sheer cliff. Are we really going to climb this thing? Oh right, their their quest ended once they got to Mist Village in Theodore's story. Are we really going to climb this thing? It's the only way to escape from those pursuing us. But that's ridiculous. There isn't even a path for us to take. Yeah, there is. You can fucking see it. So we'll blaze one. Follow me, bitch. Oh, no. Preempt. Oh, God. Not those guys. Run away. Terrible start. Hooded man. His job class is question mark. Is questionable. <laughs> See, he doesn't even know the jump command, and he's using swords, so... But I mean, Edward wouldn't use swords either. So I don't know who the fuck this guy is. I thought for sure it was Kane until now. Uh, tr uh, treasure, obviously. High pot, and bone wrist, what the fuck, that's from Final, that's a Final Fantasy IX item, kids. Do, do, 
Now we're getting into like new stuff. Me likey. Can I? I can't get off there. Weird. Okay. Fa. Oh shit. This man's pretty fucking tough. And I I do like I like Theodore a lot actually. Da 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 Alright. That is oh, okay, never mind. I was like, that leads to nowhere. Gaia drum. What 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 is that? An an summoning item thing? The same effect as Quake. Yeah, one of those like magic item things. What are we? Oh, let's use some uh, pots on our our boy Seador. Dude, I want to go back down there now. It looks like. Hold on, hold on, guys. Me thinks me fucked up. Like, not big time, but definitely fucked up. Those goblin captains give a lot of EXP, and I'm hoping the gremlins do as well. Alright, hooded man. Who the fuck are you? Like, why wouldn't he at least give Theodore, like, a fake name? Because how the fuck is Theodore supposed to address him? Theodore and hooded man both gained a level. All right, let's try going below, like here. No? Damn. Okay. Well, fuck me, Fridays. I thought, I thought we were, uh, you know, thought I was on to something there. I think this Naga can cast, like, silence, so we gotta be careful. Oh, you son of a bitch. Die, blocks. There we go. Alright, let's use uh, Kira. Wow. Lots of Kira, apparently. Okay. We are almost to the top. I think. I really don't know. Ooh, we got treasure over here. Oh, look at that background, man. That's beautiful. Is that sleep blade? Is that what that said? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Equipment. Sleep when used as an item. Oh, it doesn't, like, do it when I hit people with it, though. That's dumb. Alright. Mist cliff what? Paraclips? Precipice. Precipice? I don't know how to pronounce that. SAVE THE GAME! Alright, there's gotta be a boss fight or something. Or do we just like, go off down the other side now? Okay, that makes sense. I love that he like, oh no! Theodore, my boy! Oh shit, you okay? Yeah, I think so. Hang on. Hang on, there might be treasure over here. <laughs> Fuck! I gotta fight by myself. Oh shit. Think of the EXP though. Let's do it. Do it for the EXP. It's gonna be so much. Oh my god! Good thing he's got a fuckload of hit points. If I can take down this uh, ice lizard or whatever. Frost, frost fucker. And then now I'll just use uh, I'll use an X potion. I think that heals like a thousand? I might be wrong though. 2,000! That was a waste. That was a fucking waste right there. Uh-oh. Not good. If I get stoned, I'm... Okay, it does It does uh, put them to sleep when I hit them with it. Cool. If I get turned to stone, then it's uh, game motherfucking over, kids. Oh, shit. Why does that guy hit so hard all of a sudden? Dead, bitch. Look at that EXP, though. Totally worth it. Wow. Another waste. Just wasting items like that. Oh no, I do not want to fight those guys. Physical attacks do no damage and I don't have any magic, so. Dude, how fucking far did that kid fall and how is he alive?
How the fuck do I get down there? Um, dude, there's so much like treasure here. Ether, okay. It looks like I can climb up here. No. Okay. Nagas. I hope they die in one hit. Oh, they're good, they do. I just gotta go faster. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Sonic X. Never actually saw Sonic X, and I'm a big Sonic fan. Never seen a single episode. I saw the Saturday AM and the, uh, um, I watched a fuckload of Sonic, The Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog, because it was on every morning before school. Oh, I see. This probably goes like, well, he's just like dead. Flame shield. Cool. Oh, what? It sucks. Well, that's, that's not cool, man. I love that he's just like face planted. Are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Sorry about that. If you're sorry, then be more careful next time. Yes, sir. There we go, that's for Theodore. Doing some climbing. No! Not an egg. Could be anything. And we're both in the back party, so that's cool. Oh, we put the egg to sleep. Yeah, that makes sense. Does that mean it can't hatch if it's asleep? Like, probably, right? Because it would have hatched by now, I would think. God damn it. Fucking back party bullshit. Can you die, please? Thank you. Oh, I can go, I can go fast. I wasn't sure if I could or not. We did eat! Looks like we're through. Can't believe I made it down the side of that cliff in one piece. But you did, and you did it all by yourself. Are you kidding me? I never could have done it without you. Don't underestimate yourself. I only, I only provided you with the opportunity. You're the one who saw it through to the end. Yeah, you're right. What's this? An enemy? What's that? Oh, that's what we climbed, was that cliff in between. Oh, it's an airship. Just you wait, Cecil. What the fuck, dude? There's two canes. Doesn't make sense, man. The Red Wings. Well, maybe that is Edward. No, you're wrong. What? The Red Wings are the most elite airship fleet in the skies. The soldiers manning the airship up there are no Red Wings. They're just mindless drones. True enough. That means they're still on our trail? No, they're heading in another direction. That's the way to Damsian. Wait, you don't think they'll attack Damsian, do you? There's no time to lose. Let's head northeast to Kaipo first. Got it. The me I see reflected in my mirror. Ha! Long have I awaited this moment. What happening? Jump! Ow. You can tell that's not Edward. He actually has some use, both storyline and in battle. <laughs> Maybe it's Edward, man. It's probably Edward. I mean, Edward is the most powerful Dragon Quest character, or sorry, Final Fantasy character of all time. So it's obviously fucking Edward. Oh my god. I hope I'm supposed to lose this fight. Ugh. How did you... 
I've finally been released. Freedom is mine at last. Fabul's crystal is mine. That just leaves one more. Oh, so did like the kind of evil side of Cain escape from that that realm? So does that mean if like if Cecil would have like lost to the Dark Knight, there would have been like a Dark Knight Cecil and a Paladin Cecil? Both? That's word. Desert travel is far more fatiguing than you think. Let's rest at the inn first. Certainly. Certainly. Ah, travelers, watch out for desert fever. Look out for that beaver fever. I saw another Red Wing airship flying northbound just now. That's towards Damsian territory. Your mom's towards Damsian territory. <laughs> Burn. The only way to Damsian from them here is through the northwest, the underground waterway to the northeast. Oh, wow. Get some like OP fucking shit here. Also, WTF man, look at my gold. I'm gonna go with the chainmail. Yeah, let's just go with uh Whoa! Wowzas! Yeah, let's go with uh two of these. And now we're broke as fuck. Ross Helm. Protect against blind? Very useful. That would be very useful in, uh, fucking Final Fantasy Brave Exvius, to be honest. Because as soon as my, as soon as, like, Yang gets, uh, fucking blind casted on him, he's, like, completely fucking useful, useless. The underground waterway to the northeast is home to a fearsome array, a fearsome array of monsters. Bitch, you haven't met Edward, all right? The most powerful bard in all the land. Holy shit balls! Okay, let's see what we can sell. Mithril helm, iron armor, iron sword, wizard's hat, mithril armor. Holy shit! Iron gloves. Uh, Mithril Gloves, Balshian, Bronze Shield, Chainmail, Steel Helm, Turban, Training Garb. Look at that shit, man. Now we're talking. I don't think I can buy two, but... Yeah, I can definitely buy one. Almost two. Dude, I'll be able to buy two. Also, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know who this fucking guy is. Sleep Blade. Sleep Blade is pretty cool, to be honest. I wonder if I should, like, keep that for, uh, Seodor. Yeah, let's do that. Seodor's weaker anyways. Sleep Blade, uh, nah, fuck it. The odds of it actually, like, working are probably pretty low. So let's unequip it. Wait, 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 wait. Coral Sword. Ba bam bitch. Now can we afford it? Ba bam bitch. Alright, let's get the fuck on out of here. Now that we're all jacked up and ready to fuck. Hmm, say, have I seen you somewhere before? Uh maybe. Get the fuck out of my way. You're still a healthy young man. I wouldn't want the desert fever cutting you down in your prime. The beaver fever. We've had many a dignitary stay here, you know. Queen, King Cecil, Queen Rosa, King Edward, too. Alright, well, should we check the graves? Aunt Anna, daughter of the great and gentle sage, rests in the desert oasis surrounded by eternal love. 
you knew these people? This is Sage Tella and his daughter, too. He fought alongside my father in the old war. What about you? Did you know about them? Let's go. Who is this guy? Alright, let's save. Head to the Ye Oldie Damsian. It sucks that you can't run on the world map, but I get it, okay? I fucking Oh no! Back attack! Let's let's GTFO, kids. By the way, folks, if you haven't yet, please kick that click that heart, show me some love, follow me here, twitch.tv slash gtf3. I would appreciate the hell out of it. Pretty much just play lately I've been just replaying all the Final Fantasy games, although this is my first time playing uh, the After Years. And it'll be my first time playing Final Fantasy X-2 when I get there, and uh, all the Final Fantasy XIII games, I've never played any of them. I most certainly will not click that heart. Yes, you you don't, Kato, because that would unfollow. <laughs> How's it going, dude? How's it going, butter? How was X-Men for you? Did uh, did Professor Xavier bring you lots of gifts? This underground waterway seems like it'll be so troublesome. Let's rest up and resupply at Kaipo first. Oh, I'm supposed to actually like stay at the inn there? Okay. Plot and shit. Not bad. Yeah, same here, man. Not bad at all. All right, to the inn. The gravestones by the spring belong to Sage Tella and his daughter Anna. Uh, oh, yeah, sure. Let's buy one of those. I don't know how expensive the inn is. Not really. Got family coming in this weekend, so the X Men will be late. Oh no! Spent the day watching a Bob Ross marathon and sewing. Well, that's impressive. My dad could sew, but I could not sew. Oh no, I'm flat broke. Now, how are we supposed to plot? Yahoo, that dancer is fantastic, splendid. She sure knows her way around the dance floor. They hired me on as a dancer here, can you believe it? Would you like to watch me dance? Sure, why not? My brother and his wife are having a baby, so I'm making stuffed animals. Oh, cool. Dude, what? That's talent. That's fucking talent. Anyone else find this music kind of creepy and not, like, dancey at all? You're gonna be an uncle, boy. The new ship's route, the new ship routes really help keep things hopping around here. Mmm, the drinks here are something else, no doubt about it. No doubt about it. Uh, I'm not just handy with a rifle. I am. I'm excited. That's awesome. Is this your first niece and or nephew? I'm from Baron, actually. We're here visiting my mother's birthplace. I always wanted to see Kaipo once one more time before I died, and now my dreams finally come true. Well, that's nice. Yeah! Oh, that's pretty cool, then. That's exciting as fuck. After the first one, it's like, uh, oh, I want to see the kid, but, like, I probably, uh, might not drop everything to go meet them. <laughs> but the first one's very, very exciting. And then they just keep happening. Oh shit, we've got him. Look out, Theodore. Then again, like, I technically only have one niece, but uh, a lot of my friends and stuff, their kids call me uncle. So it's not like my friend's gonna be like, come into the delivery room and meet my child. So I guess that's, that's different. 
That's the difference. So maybe, maybe I would be as excited for the next ones, but yeah. Okay. You get the idea. Please die. Please, please die, Mr. Zombie Infantry. They're zombies! Dude, good thing I read that. I had no idea. Yeah, I hear that. <laughs> Theodore gained a level and learned float. Who, who are those soldiers just now? They weren't human. Not anymore. Oigle's nieces are n kind of my nieces. It's something, right? Yeah, it's it's something, man. It's something. I definitely care about them. I've known those kids since they were tiny. Don't show them mercy just because they're from Baron. Otherwise, you'll wind up like that yourself. I know. We need to stay on the move. When day breaks, we'll make for the underground waterway to the northeast. Yeah, like my buddy Finney's kids and Mike's kids are like referred to as uh, my nieces and nephew. But and then I have like I have a stepbrother, uh, but we're not like really close anymore. And he's got three kids. So, like, it's, like, I like them, but I don't have, like, a lot to do with them. I mean, maybe that's just my bad. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a fucking asshole. Maybe that's what it is. I mean, they like me. So that's cool. I mean, the other one's, like, a fucking baby, so, I mean, he doesn't really like anything. He must Unless it's tits. And I can I can get behind that. Yeah, my oldest brother, half-brother, has a kid. But we don't get along, so I haven't seen the kid since he was born. Yeah, man. Family. Family's a bitch. Can't, can't fucking choose your family. I mean, you can. Because you just treat people like family that you... That you really care about, and... It, don't treat people like family when they're assholes. So, that's how I've always rolled anyways. I have a slightly complicated- Oh no, attack down! Dude, we gotta use a tent. I can't- No, not Toad! Oh, you son of a bitch. Alright, somebody else cast Toad. I always forgot I need to run from these guys whenever, whenever they show up. There we go, okay. What miss? Come on, you got one fucking job to recast Toad on me. There we go, let's get the fuck out of here. It's not that, like, I don't get along with my stepbrother, we just, I don't know, we just don't have anything to do with each other anymore. When we were, like, in high school and, like, elementary school and stuff, we did, but... I literally see him once a year. At, like, I see him at, like, Christmas and that's it. Like, not even at Thanksgiving. Just like his wife will go to Thanksgiving and stuff. And I, I actually, like, I get along with her pretty good. Like, I don't, like, know her that well, but... She's super nice. And, like, he's kind of... Kind of like a douchebag. And I don't think he treats her very well. Okay, I got a, I got a tent here because... I can't go through the whole cave with my attack nerfed. So, I don't know if you ever played this game, Kato, but it plays very similar to Final Fantasy IV, but there's a moon cycle, and the phases of the moon determine like what gets buffed and what gets nerfed. Oops, why did I do that? And it's easy to manipulate, but yeah. It sometimes sucks. So, we'll use a tent, which changes the cycle of the moon, and then, uh, hopefully, waning moon is better than waxing moon or whatever we had. Alright, so, it buffs our attack and lowers techniques, but we don't have any techniques anyways, so we're good to go. Uh, I used to be all about family and whatnot, but nowadays, not so much. That is weird. Yeah, family is complicated, dude. I've always considered, I've been, I've like always considered my friends, my family, my true family. Like there was a long period of time where I had nothing to do with my family. Ice, ice shield lols? 
Flame, flame ice, ice flame, ice lulls. I don't know. Resist fire, resist ice. We're most li more likely to encounter ice enemies than fire ones down here. Yeah, so like, family's a little fucky. Is attack buffed? Because that's pretty fucking pits if it is. The thing is, it, it also buffs the enemy's attack too, so you gotta keep that in mind. But yeah, attack is buffed, so we're definitely on the good, the good moon phase. Alright, oh, here we go. Maiden's Kiss. So that Maiden's Kiss untoads you, so if you're toaded, you can untoad yourself. Instead of hoping that they cast fucking toad on you again to untoad you. God damn it. Ambush is the worst, because then you're in the fucking goddamn back party and you don't do as much damage. The only problem with, like, 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 I'm, like, a big, like, my friends are my family kind of guy, but the only problem I find, it's not, like, a huge issue, is that... Um, my friends have really good families, so, like, ideally, I would like to spend Christmas with just my friends, but they have, like, really good families, so they, they, like, spend, like, multiple days at their family's house and stuff, so I don't really get a chance to really see my friends during the X-Men season. But that's okay, because, uh, I'm going over to one of my best buds' places, uh, on Saturday. And hopefully my other best bud. We're doing a stream during the day. And uh, hopefully my other best bud can come too. But I haven't really mentioned it to him. So uh, <laughs> yeah, I should probably do that. These bats fucking, for some reason, are actually pretty annoying. Oh yeah, I do have, I have a, my buddy from Japan stays at our place during Christmas because he doesn't have any family here, obviously. Uh, so he stays with us, and we take him to like our family's Christmas and stuff. Like for the most part, I get along with my family now. But there was like a time when I didn't at all. And my wife's family is like really cool, so they're they're pretty effing nice. <laughs> A da bitch. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, and the level gains too. Let me tell you about them gains, boys. <laughs> all right, I'm all about the treasure, to be honest. A fell turtle. One fell turtle. Son of a bitch. Whoa, that was uh, damaging. Them gains. Oh yeah, brother! Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck! What is with the encounter raid in here? Oh well, preemptive strike. That's uh, what I like to call free XP. Oh yeah, brother! That's my shitty Macho Man Randy Savage impersonation. Whenever I talk about gains, for some reason, I have to, you know, do the Macho Man voice. Um. Speaking of, speaking of gains, I've been eating like an asshole all X-Men season. So, I haven't like put on any weight though, so that's good. Because I was like working out real hard before the X-Men season started. Well, yeah, like you do, right? Same. Like, are you referring to like eating like an asshole? Yeah, like I've been living off of like... Like so for Jap like we do a Japanese Christmas with my with my buddy from Japan and uh Japanese cr Christmas consists of uh KFC eating KFC with your friends. So we order like oh god, I got to run, got to run, got to run. So we uh order a bunch of KFC and eat that and uh it's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Um it's the only one day a year I eat KFC actually. Um, 
So we do that. And then I've been eating like nothing but KFC, turkey, gravy. I had some Brussels sprouts the other day and a fuckload of candy because we have like the, we play like this game at my mom's house and and you win like prizes and I won almost all the prizes and all the prizes were candy so I got like a fuckload of candy. My roommate keeps making things like chocolate Guinness cheesecake, homemade white chocolate mousse, etc. I made a pretty dank dinner last night for Imperial Sun and Oigle though. What'd you make? What'd you make, boy? What'd you make? What'd you make, brother? That was the, that was the worst. Sometimes I can do a good Macho Man impersonation, but not not today. Today is not that day. Alright, you sons of bitches. Stop hitting me for weak ass damage. You mur you mur men. I love me some Brussels sprouts. It's kind of like weird, like a lot of people don't like it, I guess. But I, it just tastes like strong broccoli, and I like broccoli. Your mind was just blown. Why? Dragon Quest Eleven stuff? Steak, sauteed some veggies, rice, broke out some good beer, it was great. Dude, I love steak. I need to get a fucking barbecue. Like, literally, I make the best, like, some of the best steak ever. I'm not even fucking bragging. It's been told to me by multiple people. But I've been, uh... Ha ha! I know what happened, Fates. Right? They hid the shit out of that character, hey? Like, I thought for sure that would have leaked somehow. Especially from like trailers and stuff. And then yeah, all of a sudden, BAM! This character joins your party that you never would have saw coming. Fuck Dragon Quest XI so good. Anyways. Um, what was I talking about? I don't remember what I was talking about. This dude's like fucking Leviathan over here. I think I'm gonna have to call in sick tomorrow. My mind was blown so hard. Yeah, dude. Call in sick. Uh, donate a fuckload of bits to my stream. Um, and play Dragon Quest XI all day. I'll even, uh, I'll pretend I'm your doctor and be like, yeah, uh, I'll be, I'll be like, yeah, uh, Fate's Rage, uh, is in, in the ICU. And they'll be like, who the fuck's Fate's Rage? And I'll be like, uh, I gotta go! <laughs> oh, Charity, what does that mean? I don't even know, how do I, what, how, what, how, who? Um, man, I am so glad this wasn't ruined for me, right? Dude, I was I was dodging that ruin for a long time. So does that automatically go to charity, or like how does that work then? I don't know how anything works on Twitch. Dude, Blood Feast fucking sucks. So you see, it only does 23 damage, but what it does is that you're continuously leaking hit points. Then why why is your doctor calling from a saskatchewan because you had to see a specialist obviously it's that bad what's the area code in manitoba by the way i don't even know saskatchewan's 306 and lloyd is like 780 or sorry lloyd alberta is 780 and lloyd minister is in alberta but it is also in Saskatchewan. Do they have border cities in uh, in the United States, Kato? I don't think there's very many here, but I know Lloyd Minster is uh, literally on the Saskatchewan Alberta border. And when I was a little kid, I would be like, Oh my god, let's park my car on the fucking border, even though I don't have a car because I'm a kid. I'm stupid. But like, yeah, you would be like, Mom, can we fucking stop at the border? And, and then I can be like, I can be in Saskatchewan and my sister can be in Alberta and it'll be cool for like 10 minutes. 204. Is your work pretty anal about like taking sick days? Mine is. Mine is like... If you don't have AIDS, you can't be sick. It's like, man. 
I, I fucking, uh, not feeling good. I fucking puked. Like, I'm puking right now. Would you like pictures of it? Because I can do that. If you want. And then they're like, then they're like, you have to get a doctor's note. We'll rest here. And it's like, yeah, okay, I'll just bring my fucking puke pail to the fucking hospital because we don't really have, like, doctor's office. Like, like you can't get into a doctor anymore in Canada. You have to go to, like, either the emergency room and wait for, like, a year to see a doctor. And by a year, I mean, like, I don't know, like, seven hours. Or, no, they're super cool as long as I have sick days. See, like, fuck, I wish we were like that, man. And, or, you have to, like, go to a walk-in clinic, and then walk-in clinics make you pay ten bucks. You could be, like, you could be, like, puking up blood, and they'd be like, yeah, if you want a sick note, uh, if you, if you got, if you need a sick note, it's gonna be ten bucks. And then, uh, you could also try to book an appointment with your doctor, but you'll never get in, in, like, that day. You need to pace yourself. We've got a while to go. Oh, alright, then. What's happening, bruv? Oh, he's still flying there? That's like the slowest airship ever. My beer, it's empty! Gotta go to a walk-in and pay for a note. Yeah. It's the worst, man. You guys have to do that too? You all wait for me here. But sir... Look, I know you're being controlled, but at least value your lives a little. Yes, sir. But if things prove to be more difficult than anticipated, don't count on it. Is that why Kane looks so different? Like he looks so much fucking cooler? His avatar? It's 30 bucks in the walk-in nearby my old place? What the fuck? Even if you're like puking up blood. Like if you're puking, I mean. Like normally throwing, like throwing up. Noticeably sick as fuck. They still make you pay 30 bucks? That is fucking bullshit. Don't count on it. That's bullshit, man. I keep switching between Kane and... You just call in? Yeah, see, like, I'll call in and then my manager will be like, Hey, uh, you need to, uh... Hey, I know, I noticed you texted me a picture of puke and all, but, uh... I noticed your, uh, dick fell off. And you posted a picture of your black dick on the carpet. But, uh, I'm gonna need a sick note. Or even when Kaylee is sick, that's... Oh, that's awesome, man. Here's the thing about my job, all right? My job is good, but my my boss is a complete fucking asshole. Like, not all the time, but like sometimes. You, I never expected to see you here, Kane. Oh, it's Edward. OP as fuck. He's gonna one hit kill Kane. Oh, what? They actually have a fire? I thought that's where they put their tent. Mother. Oh, he's dreaming. He's having a wet dream over Rydia. Don't blame him. Oh no! New moon! Fuck! This changes everything! We might have to use a tent. Uh, no, we're good. That's cool. We have a guy, I have a, there's a guy I work with, and yeah, he'll call in when his kid's sick and stuff. Um, the only time, the only reason we get upset about that is because he has a wife that's like a stay-at-home mom, so there's really no fucking need for him to stay home when his kid's sick, and he does, but he does it anyways, but, I don't know, whatever. It only really sucks if it's like really bit, really fucking busy. God damn it, fucking blood feast. That shit sucks, man. Look how fucking strong everyone is now. And by everyone, I mean the hooded man. Alright, man. Once I get out of this cave, I'm gonna, I am gonna—I think I'm going to call it a stream. But I will be streaming all day tomorrow, off and on. Theodore gained a level. Fantastic. Let's get some fucking treasure, boys. 
Oh, right. I was like, why is his MP not maxed, though? But he just gained a level, so. Oh, my niece got, like, a full fucking, uh, like, she's, like, hardcore into gymnastics and stuff. So she got, like, a, a gymnastics bar thing and a bunch of gymnastics stuff, all right? Oh, uh, going to bed? All right, good night, dude. Thanks a lot for tuning in, Fates. Uh, hope to see your fine ass tomorrow. Should be starting around 10 p.m. Unless I sleep in. Then it'll be like 10.30. Have a good one, dude. Not Tsunami. I thought only Leviathan could fucking use Tsunami. These motherfuckers just... Shouldn't, like, Titan be able to use Tsunami? Because technically, like... You know, it's fucking earthquakes that make tsunamis, not just fucking water. But I guess if Aquaman can make a tsunami, then so can this thing. Alright. Oh, I can't believe I missed that treasure. It was like right fucking there. Unbelievable! Die, please? So are you telling me tsunami does the same thing as Blood Feast? Let's find out. Do we get HP drainage? Uh, no, I must have been bitten by bats or something last fight, and I just wasn't paying attention. That's the thing. Once I start like, once I start drinking the beers, I stop really paying attention. Oh, this should be a good. This should be a good item. Usually, if if there's a monster in the box, then whatever's in that treasure chest is absolutely fucking worth it. Oh my goodness! Hooded man just ate shit. Let's go for full offense. Full offense, boys! Oh no! Okay, no no more full offense. If Theodore gets a turn, then we'll uh, use Cura on Hooded Mang. <laughs> Fuck off, man! Die, please? There we go. Ice Brand! There we go. New Sword. Oh wow, that's like way more powerful. Okay, we gotta use some heal zores to the max zores here. Alright. Cedor's got lots of fucking MP, dude. He's like the best parts of Rosa and the best parts of Cecil combined. It's pretty fucking tits, actually. Eat ice. Ice to meet you. Chill out. Chill out. Oh, that sucks, man. Don't use Tsunami. Don't use Tsunami. Oh, you son of a bitch. He used Tsunami. What kind of piece of shit uses a Tsunami? Tsunami? Dead bitch. Alright, let's fucking keep on keeping on. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Do we have to fight that fucking octopus again? Because that would suck. I've only fought him like, you know, like four times. No big deal. Okay, we're good. Do, 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 do. No, 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 no. Not toads, man. Anything but toads. Like, I don't like fighting the bats, and I don't like fighting the Miz Mizuchi. But, like, the bats can suck a big ol' ding-dong. I mean, the toads can suck a big ol' ding-dong. There we go. Hooded man gained a level. fan fucking nasdaq Great for him. See ya, fates. Alright, dude, what? I thought there was a fucking healing station over here. Oh, and we're ambushed. We just got wambushed, boys. Oh, nice. The secrets are f for reals. I have no idea where I'm going right now. Oh, what? That was, uh, something. Hey, remedies are good to have. Don't know if it's worth walking all that way, though. 
It's a pretty fucking long walk, dude. I pot, and let's go. Okay, we're almost at the end of this place, anyways. Son of a bitch! Ambushed again? Dude, if this guy casts Toad, that's gonna effing suck. Okay, good. It's GTFO. So yeah, Kato, in case you haven't figured it out, Theodore is uh, Cecil and Rose's son. And he's he's uh, pretty damn good, actually. Because he's like Cecil, but he learns... He has way more MP and learns way more healing magic. Thanks to his mom. God damn it. All the fucking special encounters here. At least that guy's not casting Toad. Like, I've got to be thankful for that at the very least. Alright. Treasure is more important than, like, literally anything. Phoenix down and... Dry Ether. Dry Ethers are pretty good. Phoenix down. Eh, don't really need it. I see sunlight. We aren't through this yet. Watch yourself. Right. You cleared the room for me, didn't you? Nice to see a show of courtesy from you. Uh-huh. Will you continue this act of kindness and hand over the fire crystal? Is that what you're really after? It's not the main thr it's not the main thrust of my business, but yes. So what are you really after? I'm going to kill Cecil. Have you seen him yet? Not yet. That's why I'm here. I see. Sadly, I'm afraid I can't let you have my crystal. Even if it costs your life. That's right. Let me put you out of your misery, then. Kane, stop! Who is it? Rosa? Oh, dude, it's Rosa. Cool! Alright. Well, damn. Um, I'm gonna save it here and call it a night. Thank you guys so much for coming out. If you haven't yet, please follow me here at uh, twitch.tv slash yuki03. You can uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel be noted to, to uh, check out all my past streams. And, uh... Check me out on Facebook to be notified of what and when I'll be streaming next. But the best place, of course, to stay in touch is the Discord. All the links have been posted in the chat. I will see you fine fucks tomorrow. I'll be streaming during the day as well as in the evening. So, uh, yeah, you guys have a fantastic rest of the night. Have a good sleep, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, I'll also be streaming, should be streaming Friday night. Uh, at about, I don't know, like 7.30, maybe 8 o'clock. Probably 8 o'clock, actually, because I, I work till 6. And then uh, Saturday afternoon I'll be streaming, and then, of course, Sunday as well. Thank you, guys. Goodbye, and good night.